shopping to do before the holidays arrive. Uh, you better watch this report. Our Evan Peterson is uh, live at Mitchell International Airport with a look, though, at how some people are uh, moving from shopping to travel this year. Yeah, hey there, guys. Good evening. Yeah, whether you're jumping in the car, taking the train, or flying to get where you need to go, it's safe to say that you're probably not going to be alone in your holiday commute. It's one of the busiest times of year, the December holidays. The next two days are going to be busy, but uh, God bless. But for Brent Dewald, he's getting an early Christmas gift before hitting the roads. I thought they'd be going up, to be honest with you, this time of year. Low gas prices. Ain't going to lie, I saw the 189. Uh, I was above half a tank, and you never know what's going to happen with gas prices. So I said, why not? But for others, they prefer to trade in the roads for the rails. My girlfriend and her family live down there and celebrating Christmas Eve there and then we'll make our way back up Christmas Day to be with my family. But to get a truer sense of holiday travel, the airport is where you can see it all. People arriving to open arms of loved ones or receiving a big hug before saying goodbye to board a plane. My sister's in New York and she has three kids as well so we were trying to you know, do double duty. For the Nixes, grandma is leaving town after spending a week visiting her newest grandchild. And thankfully, her plane is right on time. Smooth sailing, nice weather, no snow, no wind. Whether you're going to the holiday party or you're hosting it this season, it's not so much how far you travel, but rather what you do once you arrive. Just wish everybody peace and happiness and love. And as you can see behind me, things are pretty calm at the airport tonight. But if you're going to be coming out here, catching a flight later this evening, a bit of friendly advice here. TSA tells me that if you're bringing gifts through the security there, make sure they're unwrapped. Otherwise, they'll have to unwrap it for you. Reporting live this evening at General Mitchell International Airport, I'm Evan Peterson, Fox 6 News. Good advice there. Thanks, Evan. For those people heading some.